Good afternoon, folks. <coughs> Excuse me. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 1 p.m. update. Slightly mixed bag out here. you got the NASDAQ and the NASDAQ Composites. NASDAQ 100 and the NASDAQ Composite are still green, up 10 points and 15, respectively. Other than that, you've got a sea of red. The Dow's off 164. The S&P's down 13. Russell's off 7. Semi's off 49. Tranny's down 79. You've got gold trading out at 1832. That's off six bucks. Silver's down 30 pennies. 2111 is the print there. Lights we crude off two bucks and change down at 10401. Natural gas off 61 cents. That's a big move. That's a 9% move. Trade down at 625. The 30 treasury at one point and 1930 seconds. 13718 is the print there. If we go take a look at our nine panel market update chart, we look at the ES mini. We can still see that the ES mini, that's your upper left hand panel, is trading above the center of its bullish structured daily profile. As long as price remains above 37.40, suggest a move to 38.41. That move to 38.41 needs the spot politics to continue to move lower, uh, approach its 50-day exponential moving average, which is at 28.09, and quite frankly, close below that level. Until it does that, it says uh, we've got a very bumpy market. If you take a look at the NQ, Finding resistance up at the top of its profile, 11.716. U.S. dollar index consolidated with inside its daily profiles. That's between 101, I'm sorry, 103.62 and 105.65. Uh, gold is consolidating with inside its daily profile, anywhere from 18.13 up to 18.79. Silver is testing the bottom of its weekly profile. That's support, 21.03. We're trading right now at 21.06. Light speed crude. This could be day number two below the bottom of its, uh, no, that's not the bottom. That's a center of its weekly profile that's at 106.21 could be stiggling to move all the way back to the 94.11 area natural gas is trading below a new bullish structure but it's, it's actually a bullish structured profile that formed yesterday so this could be day number two well this would be day number one below the bottom of that level and that suggests lower price out there in the 30-year treasury she's going to go target resistance a resistance to the top of its daily profile and that's at the one 3809 level out here. Our focus today, we'll take a look at it, certainly as we open up the uh, Trader's Edge show, is going to be on the 30-minute uh, charts out there for the equity future contracts. And the reason is because those are the ones that have the topping signals in place. And uh, those are Rosemont to Indicator tops. Right now, the NQ is testing a key level of support. That's the bottom of its 30-minute profile. That's at the 11565 level. A close below that at 130 suggests lower price is coming. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader Zed Show. We're off to start your Thursday. Have a terrific one, and we'll look forward to speaking to you again soon.